Alright, this is the most compact smelter setup I've been able to come up with in ministry. It is tileable, which is really cool. And here's just a single unit of the tile. You can see how it's made up. Um, and you can just tile it as many times as you like. So, you place the, the smelter to a part, and then you just uh, copy this exactly sideways, up, um, up. You got the junction on either side. There's a router under the left one with uh, two vertical conveyors next to it, facing upwards. Um, next you put a conveyor going into both of the junctions, overflow gate next to that. You can just send conveyors through this. Alright, so now you can just link up your resources. Like that. You also have to have the coal, of course. It just works. Um, of course, like I said, it's tileable, so you can repeat it as many times as you like, or maybe not as many times as you'd like, but as many times as it is possible for you to uh, supply it with the resources necessary. So you can connect them up again, you know, now that there's three instead of just two. Uh, I forgot to add the output on there. And the input conveyors. And there you go. It's all done. This one will continue outputting. You know, I'll make a really long conveyor. You know, in fact, since I'm in... And it's pretty fast. Um, I haven't done any actual calculations, but you can see. It's about... One Mississippi, two Mississippi. You know, about two every second. Uh, and that's just with three. And they're not even filling up because my supplies aren't good enough. Anyway, that's it.